Welcome ladies and longbowmen to today's video where I'll be trying to attempt to where uh, as you've seen in the title probably a single unit type video which is cavalry only since I usually really don't like to play as cavalry I was thinking about doing a single unit type only but infantry is easy cannons maybe later navy doesn't even make sense I mean <laughs> maybe navy <laughs> but I thought I'd go for, ca for cavalry now so how I'm going about this, I'm not going to delete my army, I'm just not going to use them, I'm not going to put any generals on these units, so I'm really just going for cavalry. And I already moved Dabrowski a little bit, and I'm going to end my turn here. So I'm going to go for the usual strategies of declaring war on Sardinia, so the French take them out, and declaring war on the Portuguese, so the Spanish take them out. So I'm really not going to do anything, I'm just going to defend, I'm not even going to attack this guy with my cannon. And I have no idea how this is gonna go. I saved up a little bit of my money for heavy cavalry. And I'm gonna use my only other cavalry general. So I have no idea how good this actual will go. <laughs> I don't have a too good feeling. And I'm basically banking a bit on my allies doing well and playing as Poland is gonna be quite harsh to be honest. The problem with this cavalry is that a lot of my units are super expensive. Yeah, let's hope the French do well. So Sweden and Denmark joined and I desperately have to keep Prussia out of this because my god they will stomp me in the moment I'm super weak but I have to try to do is oh my god I'll have to put like my good generals like my oh wait a second Davu you are so pretty look what he's doing oh he just got me a city wonderful and I, well, I have to I have to get this <laughs> stable because otherwise I can't <laughs> produce any units <laughs> Yeah, I will have to put <laughs> my normal generals on cavalry. It's a <laughs> Come on, France. How long does it take to take out the Sardinians? Okay, so I have enough money to build the next. Oh, I attacked the wrong guy. I think I'm just. I'll, I'll... Am I allowed to build militia? I don't think so. It's, it's cavalry only, so I have to go. Wow, it's horrible. Okay, so I've got a cavalry and I have to put a good general on it because I'll put... <laughs> Look at that Carl! You feel... <laughs> he looks like an ugly duckling on that, <laughs> on that horse. <laughs> He's probably feeling like, why you do this to me, Jules? <laughs> why? What have I done to you? I'm so good on infantry. I can't even take the Vue out. I'll take the Vue out just to put some to put Dabrowski there. Oh, why did I take Po? I should have taken a major nation. My god, so many stupid decisions. Maybe this is gonna be like a super short, super faily video. But I'll see in a sec. Look at my abuse, Carl. The ugly, uh, ugly duckling. Okay, Dabrowski should be out of ra range for these guys. Come on, Dabu, kill him. Ah, shambles. I've got enough money for the next cavalry. <laughs> I'm going to disband this guy. Oh my god. This is such a stupid idea. Why, why am I doing this? <laughs> oh my god. Wait, oh no, Fran <laughs> Prussia joined. I am, I am so done. I am so done. <laughs> Look at my crippled army. I really basically have to deploy like every channel I have. On, like, some and, oh my god. But Davu is really strong. Without Davu, this would be impossible. Yeah, look now. I have to put Washington on this next cavalry. Oh my god. Uh, please, France, help. Please. I need help a lot. So, guys, Sardinia is finally done. France, you were super inefficient. That Nine rounds. Usually I have like three till five. Come on, do it. Take. Yeah. Oh, Davu is actually saving me real bad. Look at the most stupid move I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put this infantry here so just he can keep the stable. I'm gonna leave the city open. Just can't do anything different. Not sure my nation decision was very smart, but I'm, I, I'm gonna stick with it now. Well, I've got enough money now for the next <laughs> Lancer. <laughs> I put uh, <laughs> I put Wellesley on it. <laughs> oh my God, they look so. I think I'm, I can't. I can't leave Krakow undefended. Somebody save me, please. Cavalry is super expensive. I'm just noticing now how super expensive they actually are. Okay, W, you have to lose. You could you have to be able to attack it. You are such a god. And I have to like shift around my units. Oh no, he can't reach it. Please tell me. Oh, I, that was an accident. Well, lots is gone, and Varsau basically. Too. I'm gonna, ch I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I'm gonna keep Varsau. You never saw that. I don't know what you're talking about. 
I'm legally blind, doesn't count. France help, please. I'm, I'm very helpful otherwise, please. Carl, do your job, kill it. <laughs> they're so weak because they're not usually cavalry. I have to send Tabu to help, actually, it's super bad. So now I can sacrifice <laughs> Wellesley there just to build another cavalry. <laughs> and make something stupid like putting Napoleon on the cavalry. Do you know how bad he must feel about himself? I'm gonna send Washington out. He can't take that much damage each round. It's not very smart. How are my allies doing? Italy, please. France. I need you. I'll attack Krakow. <laughs> With Washington. I mean, he still does decent damage. I'm not gonna put Napoleon into Warsaw. I feel like really stupid doing this challenge. But it's, I mean, it's a challenge. They aren't supposed to be easy. Oh, the Ottomans joined. Can I, can I still pay out the Russians to stay out one round more? Be yes, I can. Oh my god. Might, might save me. If we can somehow kill off the Austrians in a decent amount of time. I mean, the French are going to help the Italians and the Portuguese are almost done. I think it should be possible. I just have to somehow kill off the Austrians super fast. If that's possible, then this conquest is maybe doable. If not, then yeah, rip. At least they can move quite far. That's quite nice. I'm like trying to count the positives of this whole thing. There aren't many. I'm going to save Napoleon and sacrifice Warsaw. Do I have anywhere still stable? I've got no stables. <laughs> Do I have to actually build stables? There's, aren't they super expensive? How? Oh no, they're too expensive. This is such a bad idea. <laughs> uh, what was I thinking? I think we're still gonna do it just because my allies are sweeping the floor with the enemies. Just getting carried by the French because they were buffed. Take Budapest. Do it. Yes, do it. Do it now. And he can't reach it. Well, next round the Russians are gonna join it then. Yeah. I can't defend any cities, logically. Uh, it's really stupid. Okay, Russia joined. The only thing I can do is actually just try to get new cities every time because, yeah, my north is looking horrific. And I can't build any units anywhere. I've got no stables. <laughs> my country isn't stable. How did I come up with this and why am I doing this? It's just so many questions. Oh my god, I can actually think I can kill. What did Austrians still hold? Oh, they hold Warsaw! <laughs> My capital! Yeah, I rush back to the Russian front, even though, I mean, what am I gonna do? It's like my four cavalries are all super weak because they're not actually cavalry generals. <laughs> but without generals, it would be impossible to even think about doing this. Yeah, my allies are actually carrying me hardcore. I am the ugly duckling in this conquest. Usually the whole, the whole allies are my, the ugly duckling, but now I, it's just obviously me. Can't even build any units anywhere. I, I, well, I got, I got. Oh, I actually have a stable. Ooh, musket cavalry. And I'm gonna put the abused Kutuzov on there. Here's my. <laughs> it just feels so stupid to put super strong generals on the wrong units. I feel like, like I said before, I feel like I'm abusing them. He just feels right because he's strong on cavalry. Everybody else is like, what am I, what am I doing here? What is this? What is this whole thing? Please explain. Okay, so the Danes are doing well. Spanish is slowly going on for... Yeah, it's not looking too bad. It's not looking too bad. Little update, I'm holding none of my legitimate Polish lands. <laughs> and I'm kind of in Austria now. I don't really know what's happening in Scandinavia, but you probably should go and check out a doctor, because this is not looking healthy. Same goes for Central Europe. This is just a mess of colors. Look at this. Ugh. See a doctor, Central Europe. See a doctor. Oh, I can put it in Prussia. This is gonna relieve a lot of stress, which is pretty nice. What is Russia have so many cannons? Are they like doing cannons only, or what is this? Look, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What? What is Russia doing? Russia just decided to also make a challenge in my video. Russia, it, it's not about you this time. Come on. Okay, so Denmark got their stuff checked out. They look a bit. They look a little bit better. It's kind of depressing that I uh, nowhere can send any generals out of any cities. Because if I do, then I can't build any units there and I can't really make up for it. It's like if you cry every time. So Sweden's dead. And for time reasons, I'm gonna end uh, the video here. It's obviously who's gonna win now. Look at Britain, they're basically done. And, I mean, no, they're not really done, but Spain has landed and Russia's done, so soon this whole army will turn around. I'm not really willing to spend all this time trying to <laughs> use my stupid cavalry. But if you're gonna look, Smolets would have fallen this round. I'm gonna take it just to demonstrate. 
and the war is over basically. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you survived it. This was actually quite a kind of a stupid idea, but I just thought I'd do it. Why not? I mean, stupid ideas can be funny or entertaining or whatever. I don't know what you get out of it. But yeah, thank you for watching. Join my Discord, link in the description. And okay. Bye.